Hallelujah, blessings family. It is such a blessing to connect with you once again. Welcome back. Today we will be declaring over the month of April. We know very well that the way we begin will determine how we end. Right now we're going to give thanks to the God of heaven. We thank him for victory that he has given us for the first three months of the year. We thank him for the grace that has been so clear in our lives, in our families, careers, and in our ministry. We thank God for victory. We thank him for preserving us all through up until now by his grace and by his life and by his might in the name of Jesus Christ. This month of April that is just before us is a month of divine visitation. This is what I'm hearing. Somebody here is about to be visited for their miracle. There will be an angelic visitation. In Luke chapter 1 verse 28, we see the angel of the Lord visiting Mary, greeting her, saying, you are favored among all women. I see the same angel visiting someone here, visiting a man, visiting a woman, telling them, you are favored among all men. You are favored among all women. You are favored among your peers. You are favored among your colleagues. In the name of Jesus Christ, in this month of April, you will see the power of God work in your life. We are going to declare, and as we declare, I want you to connect by faith, and you will see the power of God do wonders, work marvelously in this month of April, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. O God of heaven, by the power of your word, let this season, let this new month, let the month of April be a month of divine visitation. Father, I pray over your people. Let this month bring about testimonies of increase, of diligence, of prosperity, of direction. Testimonies of good things in the lives of God's people. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, as I declare over their lives, I declare by the power of the Holy Ghost, that grace and favor will be their portion. From this month of April throughout the year, they will testify of the great wonders of the Almighty God. Where they have seen disgrace, let them testify of the wonders of God and of the grace of God. Where there has been disfavor, let them testify of the great favor of God. In the name of Jesus Christ, almighty God, by the power of your word, I declare from this moment right now that everyone listening to the sound of my voice, their lives will reflect the glory of God. Whatever that the word of God has been said or has declared concerning their lives, it shall come to pass. Whatever prophetic word that is good, that is taking them to their next level, that has been declared over their lives, it will come to pass. Almighty God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, we have seen and heard of your glorious things that you have done. We have believed and we have loved your mighty works. Father, I pray that everyone listening to the sound of my voice will testify of your mighty works. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, I terminate whatsoever the enemy has used to connect your people, their family, their career, their lives, O oh God, into what is not of you. Whatever Lord God Almighty has been said concerning their lives, that does not bring good things in their lives. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we terminate it right now. 
by the power of the Holy Ghost, by the power in the word of the Lord, we pull down any altar that is fighting them, that is fighting whatever that they've been trying to do. We declare in the month of April, my God, that this month will be a month of great things, will be a month of testimonies in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I declare right now, because we are the children of Abraham, we declare the blessings of Abraham are established in all that concerns us. I declare those blessings are established over everyone listening to the sound of my voice right now. They are established over their families in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My God and my Father, I declare in this month of April going forward, no one will die. No one will lose their loved ones prematurely. They are friends in the name of Jesus. No one will lose their family. No one will lose their business. No one will lose their career. No one will lose, oh God, their ministry. In the name of Jesus, whatsoever that the plan of evil has set up against them, right now we terminate it. I declare, O oh God, as your servant, that the month of April is blessed. The rest of the year is blessed. This will be a month of divine visitation. This will be a month of good news. The angels are delivering divine packages of testimonies to your people. I declare in this month, it will be a month of deliverance. In this month of April, it will be a month of success. It will be a month of freedom. It will be a month of elevation. In the mighty name of Jesus, thank you, my God, for it is done in Jesus' mighty name. As you connect to this declaration, I want you right now to pray. Take three minutes praying and say, God, this fourth month will be my month of divine visitation. Wherever there has been affliction, wherever there has been tears, wherever there's been cries, wherever there has been sorrow in any area of your life. You will begin to mention it, be clear in the presence of the Lord and declare, God, let there be divine visitation in that area. Let angels of deliverance, angels of healing, angels of prosperity be released unto you in that very area. The month of April is your month of angelic visitation. It is your month of great testimonies to the glory of the living God. If you've been blessed, declare and say, God, this is my month of divine visitation in the name of Jesus. If you are here for the very first time, make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out on what God or any word that will come from the Lord to inspire you, to cause you to be victorious every day of your life. In the name of Jesus, I speak over your life. I prophesy over your life. You are blessed. Anything that concerns your life is blessed. Your month of April is blessed. In the name of Jesus, I declare. If you are already in the month of April, you are in your season of divine visitation. If you are still about to enter this month as people are in different time zones, I declare you are about to enter a month, your month of divine visitation in the name of Jesus Christ. God bless you and shalom to you all.